Want to boost your blood flow and improve your overall health greatly? Here are 5 foods that you should eat. These foods are packed with nutrients that can help to improve circulation, reduce inflammation, and protect your heart. So what are you waiting for? Start eating these foods today and feel the difference. The last food listed is especially helpful to maximize your blood flow. We also give you tips on how best to incorporate these foods into your diet. Here are the five foods. First up is pomegranate. Pomegranate is a good source of antioxidants. The antioxidants in pomegranate can help to protect your blood vessels from damage and improve blood flow. Antioxidants are a substance that can help to protect your cells from the damage caused by free radicals. These free radicals are unstable molecules that can damage your cells and contribute to the development of chronic diseases. Pomegranate contains nitrates. Nitrates are compounds that can help to dilate blood vessels and improve blood flow. They do this by increasing the production of nitric oxide, a gas that relaxes the muscles in your blood vessels. Pomegranate has anti-inflammatory properties. Inflammation is a natural immune response, but chronic inflammation can damage your blood vessels and contribute to heart disease and other health problems. The anti-inflammatory properties of pomegranate can help to reduce inflammation and improve blood flow. Here are some ways to incorporate pomegranate into your diet. Eat fresh pomegranate seeds. Drink pomegranate juice. Add pomegranate powder to smoothies, yogurt, or oatmeal. Sprinkle pomegranate seeds on salads or other dishes. Second one is onions. Onions are a good source of quercetin, an antioxidant that can help to improve blood flow. Onions contain compounds that can help to lower blood pressure. A study published in the journal, Hypertension, discovered that people who ate onions for 12 weeks had much lower blood pressure than those who did not eat onions. 2. Reduce inflammation. Onions contain quercetin, which has anti-inflammatory properties. Inflammation can damage your blood vessels and contribute to heart disease and other health problems. The anti-inflammatory properties of onions can help to reduce inflammation and improve blood flow. Onions contain compounds that can help to prevent blood clots. Blood clots can block blood vessels and lead to heart attack or stroke. The compounds in onions can help to keep blood flowing smoothly and prevent blood clots from forming. Onions contain soluble fiber, which can help to lower cholesterol levels. High cholesterol levels can increase your risk of heart disease. The soluble fiber in onions can help to remove cholesterol from your blood and improve your cholesterol levels. Here are some ways to incorporate onions into your diet. Eat raw onions in salads or sandwiches. Cook onions in stir fries, soups, or stews. Add onions to sauces or marinades. Make onion rings or onion dip. Number 3 is fatty fish. Fatty fish are a good source of omega-3 fatty acids, which are essential for maintaining healthy blood flow. Here are some of the specific ways that fatty fish can help to improve blood flow. Lower blood pressure. Omega-3 fatty acids have been shown to lower blood pressure, which is a major risk factor for heart disease. A study published in the journal, The Lancet, found that people who ate fatty fish twice a week had a 20% lower risk of developing high blood pressure than those who did not eat fatty fish. Reduce inflammation. Inflammation can damage your blood vessels and contribute to heart disease. Omega-3 fatty acids have anti-inflammatory properties that can help to reduce inflammation and improve blood flow. A study published in the journal, Arteriosclerosis, Thrombosis, and Vascular Biology, discovered that people who took omega-3 fatty acid supplements for 12 weeks had much lower levels of inflammation than those who did not take supplements. Protect against blood clots. Blood clots can block blood vessels and lead to heart attack or stroke. Omega-3 fatty acids help to keep blood flowing smoothly and prevent blood clots from forming. A study published in the journal, Circulation, found that people who ate fatty fish twice a week had a 40% lower risk of developing blood clots than those who did not eat fatty fish. Improve cholesterol levels. Omega-3 fatty acids help to lower triglyceride levels, 
which are a type of fat that can increase your risk of heart disease. A study published in the journal, the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, found that people who ate fatty fish twice a week had significantly lower triglyceride levels than those who did not eat fatty fish. Overall, fatty fish are a healthy food that has a number of benefits for your health, including improved blood flow. Here are some of the fatty fish that are good for blood flow. Eat grilled salmon for dinner. This is a classic way to enjoy fatty fish. Simply grill the salmon fillets with a little bit of olive oil and seasoning. 2. Make tuna salad sandwiches. Tuna salad is a great way to get your omega-3s on the go. 3. Add sardines to your lunch salad. Sardines are a great source of omega-3s and they are also a good source of protein. Simply rinse the sardines and add them to your favorite salad. 4. Make a seafood stir-fry. Simply stir-fry your favorite seafood with vegetables and a sauce. Up next is cinnamon. It is a good source of antioxidants and has anti-inflammatory, anti-diabetic, and antimicrobial properties. Cinnamon has been shown to improve blood flow in several ways. It can help to dilate blood vessels, which allows blood to flow more easily. Here are some of the specific ways that cinnamon can help to improve blood flow. Reduces inflammation. Cinnamon contains antioxidants that can help to reduce inflammation. Inflammation can damage your blood vessels and make them more likely to narrow. By reducing inflammation, you can avoid damage to blood vessels that can cause blockages. Lowers blood sugar levels. Cinnamon can help to lower blood sugar levels by increasing the production of insulin and improving the way your body uses insulin. Insulin is a hormone that helps your body to use glucose for energy. Overall, Cinnamon is a healthy spice that has a number of benefits for your health, including improved blood flow. Adding cinnamon to your diet is a good place to start. Here are some ways to incorporate cinnamon into your diet. Sprinkle cinnamon on your oatmeal, yogurt, or toast. Add cinnamon to your coffee or tea. Use cinnamon in your cooking, such as in curries, stews, or desserts. Take cinnamon supplements. However, it is important to talk to your doctor before taking cinnamon supplements, as they can interact with certain medications. The recommended daily intake of cinnamon is 1-6 grams. However, it is important to start with a small amount and gradually increase the amount you consume to avoid side effects such as nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea. Last one and great for snacks is nuts and seeds. They are a good source of nutrients that are essential for good health, including healthy fats, fiber, vitamins, and minerals. They are also a good source of arginine, an amino acid that is important for blood flow. Here are some of the specific ways that nuts and seeds can help to improve blood flow. Increase nitric oxide production. Arginine is converted to nitric oxide in the body. Nitric oxide is a gas that helps to relax the muscles in your blood vessels, which allows blood to flow more easily. Lower blood pressure. Nuts and seeds have been shown to lower blood pressure, which is a risk factor for heart disease. Reduce inflammation. Inflammation can damage your blood vessels and make them more likely to narrow. Nuts and seeds have been shown to reduce inflammation. Protect against blood clots. Blood clots can block blood vessels and lead to heart attack or stroke. Nuts and seeds have been shown to protect against blood clots. Improve cholesterol levels. Nuts and seeds have been shown to improve cholesterol levels, which can also help to improve blood flow. My personal favorite way to eat nuts is having them as a snack ready to eat when I'm feeling peckish. Some other ideas are. Add them to your meals. You can add nuts and seeds to your breakfast cereal, yogurt, salad, or stir-fry. Make a trail mix. Trail mixes are a great way to enjoy a variety of nuts and seeds. You can make your own trail mix or buy one pre-made. Use them as a snack. Nuts and seeds are a healthy and satisfying snack. You can eat them plain or add them to hummus or guacamole. Blend them into a smoothie. Blending nuts and seeds into a smoothie is a great way to get a boost of nutrients. Some more additional tips for eating nuts and seeds. 
Choose nuts and seeds that are raw or roasted without added salt or sugar. Store nuts and seeds in an airtight container in a cool, dark place. Eat nuts and seeds in moderation, as they are high in calories. If you have a nut allergy, avoid eating nuts and seeds. So there you have it. These are just a few of the many foods that can help to improve your blood flow. By incorporating these foods into your diet, you'll get that spring back into your step and help to boost your circulation and improve your overall health. We hope you have found this video of value. All the very best for keeping in good health.